Hello everybody, are you guys doing alright, 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 alright. Welcome to the first episode of Rise of Nations A to Z. Now, I have decided that I am going to do one country an episode. So there is going to be a lot of fucking episodes until the series over, but that will just make it a more authentic experience. So, I had already recorded a Afghanistan video, it was alright, but since I didn't know that it was only going to be one country per episode, I wanted to make a full experience. You know, unfortunately the audio crapped out, there was other people speaking in this video too, but I couldn't put them in it because the audio crapped out. But anyways, enjoy the video. Let's get into it. Alright, so what I'm doing here is I'm pretty much taking one city so I can draw all the Indian troops in and I'll move my artillery in. Because at this time, I know I had the manpower, but I just didn't have pretty much the money to sit on reinforcements. So I, I didn't have the I didn't have the money to just sit there and reinforce my tanks because that cost a lot of money. So I just figured I uh, might as well get some artillery and kill all the Indians anyway. Um I don't really know why I went after India before I went after Iran, but maybe I was just feeling a little bit goofy, but it does pay off. After somehow for forming Mughal Empire by 2023, uh, that's pretty crazy to me, uh, 2023 in a public, um, as Afghanistan, I was just like, okay, um, this is a good start, let's kick the rest of the server's ass. So, then, I decided to go after whoever I could possibly take with what little manpower and money I had. Okay, after fully, fully annexing Russia, I, I, I sort of felt a little bit of mercy for France because he was breaking apart and everything, so I just decided to take take a little bit of land off him. So, by a little bit, I mean half his country and leave him in ruins because I do as I please. Um, but at least I didn't fully annex him, so that's a little bit of clearness on the conscience. Okay, so I saw Mongolia getting absolutely bodied by Fujian, um, and I was pretty much just like, Alright, we might as well do something about this, because Mongolia worked all for this, and then Fujian is some grandmaster who's really shit at the game, who decided to join and just screw him over. So I declared war on, on the on the Vietnam, and that pulled me into the war with Taiwan, Vietnam, USA, and Fujian. So that was a good war right there, and it shows. Alright, so after annexing, like, Fujian and stuff, I was pretty much just like, well, there's pretty much no further from here for me. My allies can expand, sure, but there's not really a whole lot I can go. So I decided to just form the, form the cool empire, the Hotak dynasty, uh, with which you need Afghanistan and Iran for, because it's got a cool flag, and then I'd wrap it up there. Now... I apologize for the short video, however, um, this that's just because this video is full with voiceovers, because I screwed up the audio, oh well I didn't screw it up, the audio screwed itself up because my microphone is broken, um, but anyways, thank you all very much for watching, have a good one, this was the first episode of Rise of Nations A to Z, and I'm gonna leave you guys there.